All right, well, lucky enough, we got Herm Edwards in the house with us. Before we get started, though, how was the golf game out there? It was fun. Played with Steve Young and, and JR, so um, it was a lot of fun. It, we, we had a blast. Uh, you know, had some good holes and had some bad holes. That's I, the golf. I love it. And uh, let's go back a little bit. The high school days, what are some of the most memorable things you learned playing high school sports? Well, first thing you learn is uh, it's the building block of sports. Uh, when you start, uh, whatever you decide to go into, whether it's football, basketball, tennis, golf, it really doesn't matter. But um, you learn teamwork, uh, you learn discipline, yeah. uh, you learn trust, uh, accountability, responsibility, uh, and you learn a lot about yourself. Uh, I've always believed that sports is never about the opponent. It's about how you compete against yourself and how you reflect every time you go to work, in other words, practice, can you look yourself in the mirror and say, hey, I didn't let the team down today. So that's where it starts. It doesn't start all of a sudden if you're a college player or, or a pro player. It starts in high school. 1% of all the athletes in high school will never be a professional athlete. And uh, what do you have to say to the kids that are thinking about giving up? What do you got to say to them to just keep on trying? Well, I think once you start giving up, it becomes your personality. Yeah. Uh, you can't give up. That's that's never an option, uh, especially when you when you decide to go into something. You got to finish it. Now, once you finish it, and you say, you know what, I might not like football. Maybe I want to play basketball. Maybe I want to run track. But you can't just start giving up when things are going bad or you're not playing or whatever it may be. You got to finish it. And once you finish it, then, then you want to change. You can change.